Howdy, coy boys and cowgirls. Do you believe in ghosts? Do you think that they are communicating with us? Someone is still knocking on the walls and closing the door at Maya's house. But she has not found anyone there. She and Henry are waiting for you to solve the mystery. Until November 15, you can celebrate with us the Mexican Day of the Dead, also known as Dia de los Muertos. This day is for preparation for the following days of feast where everyone eats and dances on the graves of their past relatives. They celebrate that the departed are here with us on this special time. They come to visit us from the hereafter for a happy reunion where we can share everything with them. They are not sad, they dance and have fun because it's time to celebrate life. It is time to collect flowers called Flor de Muerto, also known as Flower of the Dead. We are also calling them Sempasuchil, which means 20 flowers in native language. These flowers are everywhere these days. They are used to decorate everything, from graves to altars. If you collect enough of them, you will get a reward for yourself and for all the players in the world. As in past years, there will be five special community rewards to unlock, which include the chess, bonds, the rivers which turn red, and achievements. And, of course, the Halloween questline, something strange is happening. To unlock those rewards, we need all of you to collect as much flowers as you can. And also, you have the opportunity to win your personal rewards, spiritualist weapons, chests with new spiritualist sets, new avatar parts, and very useful motivation and energy boxes, and of course much much more. With unlocking the game cards, you have a chance to win even more. If you want to check you and your community progress, click the event icon, which can be found on the left side of the screen. This year we improved the event window, so let's check how it works now. On the right side of the event window, you can find two icons. Globe tracking community rewards and cowboy head for having an eye on your personal rewards. Click one of them and now you can see your event progress and how many flowers you need to unlock the next reward. To change the view just click on the background of the window and choose the second icon. Easy right? Let's get back to the car game. At each stage of the car game you have to select one of two cars. Behind one car is the Aztec Sun and behind the other one is the Green Reaper. Pick the correct card and you will have the option to continue playing or catch in for a price. Otherwise, it's game over and you will receive some flowers from your efforts. There are five stages in total, roughly corresponding to the regular common, uncommon, rare and very rare categories. If you draw the wrong card at any stage, it is possible to cheat that for a cost of 25, 50, 100, 200 or even 400 nuggets respectively. Starting more games on the same day costs 25 nuggets. At stage 5, use nuggets to exchange your rewards with another random reward. And here we also have changed something. In some previous years, you have always received a box of 25 Senpasushil for drowning a Green Reaper card. This year, if you have bad luck and you choose the Green Reaper card, you can receive 25, 50, 100, 200 or 400 senpasushil flowers, depending on the stage you are in. 25 if you are in the first stage, 50 from the second, 100 from third, 200 from the fourth, and 400 from the last and fifth stage. Motivation box also have been made based on your request and it contains 10 juicy tomatoes, 10 hand rolled cigarettes, and 10 soap waters. And of course, 5 pouch of cigarette almonds. So many new things, right? And there is one thing we should not forget to tell you. How to collect all the flowers. As usual, all you need to do is work, duel, battle, adventure, or build your way to richness. You are also able to give and receive flowers, isn't that nice? You can also use flower pots that produce flowers every 11 and a half hours or 23 hours. So grab your baskets and go collect some flowers. Yeah.